It is not the amount of time you do in prayer. It is the amount of faith you put in prayer. Some people will do two hours with not a lick of faith in it. Some people do 10 hour prayer. Have you seen them? Broke, disgusted, sick, rubbish. But prayer, oh, you won't commit. They will do two days. I have a guy who used to visit me. The guy would do hours of prayer to the extent that one time he did four days non-stop. Four days. After that, you'll be asking for money. You'll be asking for other for prayer himself. Ah, his kids are in trouble. Our money is lacking. Disease is everywhere. And the guy has done four hours. No rest. And when he finishes, he'll be like, tired. He's been talking to God. The problem is, it's not the four hours. It's the amount of faith. Then some people will do two minutes. Branham, the wife is dead. He said, put your, the hand of my, my wife in my hands. Boom. Lord, help us in our time of trouble. You know that statement, you think it should carry faith in the wording of that statement. But faith speaks, the spirit of faith speaks on this wise. There is some knowledge he had that was deep down. Yes. That was carried through that statement. Help us in our time of trouble. To you, you want in the name of Jesus. He wasn't asking. Branham was not asking at that time. Brother Branham wasn't asking. He had faith contained in those statements. Loaded. Fire loaded. A lot of firepower he had in that statement. That you couldn't do anything to him. Nothing. Zero. You couldn't do anything. 